in the northeast. There are places the men cannot enter. Or there are some things the men cannot do. Like in searching of the women. Like if me I'm there, I can search the women and I can also fight with them once I have the opportunity of doing such. And I really appreciate the, our chief of army staff for creating this call. I think it's a privilege, first of all, to be among the pioneers of this women call, which is a new call. And it's a good initiative too that the chief brought this up. And when I saw my posting, I was very excited, really excited. It's going to give the women the opportunity to rise to the top. It's a very good idea for the chief of army staff to establish the Nigerian Army Women Corps. It helps the Nigerian army to, for proper administration of their female personnel. I'm saying a, big, a very big thank you to the chief of army staff for allowing me being in this call. It's really amazing. And it's, it feels very good to know about this weapon in Nigeria. Army. And being posted to female call, it will also help the female call because they have gunners that can stroop and assemble this weapon within five seconds and also every other weapon. And also, it will also help every other female soldier in other units to know that females are outside there that can do better than men and they can do what men can also do. Well, this is my first experience driving a military vehicle. It's really fun and I really enjoy driving the military vehicle. I feel motivated because it makes me to express who I am in the Nigerian Army. Not earlier than I feel I'm a woman, I will be only deployed maybe in the kitchen or office assistant. And now, this battalion makes me to feel and to express my career as a soldier. Arasa is the father of the unit, but you know I'm the mother of the unit. I'm a custodian of uh, discipline for soldiers to enforce discipline among the soldiers.